Hello, Nomad Sculpt and in version 191 there is now a Tri-Planner Texture Projection feature. Okay, so let's see. So let's use this cube here and I validate this cube. And so we need a texture for this. At the moment you see here there's um, a UV on this mesh. So when I press the inspector, um, you see here the such a cube map. And for for the tri planner thing, you don't need a UV. So you can delete here the UV. And so now you see here uh, such a yeah UV is X red. So no UV on the mesh. So we can upload here our texture. So now you see our tri planner texture. And when you press here on the texture, so here, and then a sub menu opens. And you see here the projection method um, auto or UV. Now it's set to tri planner, and the method is world at the moment. So, so when you uh, transform the the cube here, the texture, yeah, it works like this. So you can change the whole thing to local. So then when you move the object, then the texture stays in position. And so the other settings here uh, for scaling and so on. Yeah, you can play around with it. You see here the parameters for the tiling and filtering and so on. Okay. So the nice thing is when you want this here, this is now only a texture, so not a vertex paint. So here in the MISC menu, you find here the option to reproject the whole thing to the vertices. So it's set to color at the moment here, color. And we need more topology. So here the wireframe is, um, yeah, very low poly. So I walk, sorry, I go a step back. Ah. Now, okay, so let's use a little bit more topology. Remesh. So let's reproject the whole thing here. Yeah, yeah maybe in the final version this does not happen. Uh, so here when you press reproject, so at the moment the textures flip or, or rotate something, um, but reprojecting works. So now here the texture slot is empty. And now it's possible to, yeah, maybe smudge or something here, paint, and do other things with the texture. I hope it it's fixed in the final version. So this is the tri planner texture. So yeah, let's bring it back. Yeah, I haven't tested everything at the moment, so... Ah, yeah, it, it, there's an overlay. Ah, yeah, this is nice. So you can apply multiple textures. So, very nice. Okay. Yeah, sorry, I have to play with it at the moment, so... <laughs> let's, let's see what happens when I reproject it again. Okay, the old texture stays in position. Yeah, that's nice. 
So let's add a, a layer and reproject it again. Ah, yes, it's blending. So, yeah, nice thing. So, that's it. Have fun with sculpting. Ciao.